Now, you know, I'm sure you heard about this, man, but, you know, you know, speaking of fights and a lot of fights and stuff, man, uh -huh. did you hear about 6 9 getting beat up? He's a piece of shit. 6 9 Rainbow hair wearing custer ass mother. Piece of shit. Told on all his homeboys to come home early. Piece of shit. Yeah, he got beat up. Bad. Yeah, they, they, that's what continues and needs to happen. Yeah, yeah, he, he yeah. got it bad, man. Yeah, I wouldn't even go feed the homeless with a custer mother like him because I don't deal with custers. You know? Yeah, fuck 6 9 Yeah. Yeah, oh, man. I met some people like that in my life that, uh, you know, they just thought they was just gang-banging. They ain't never gang-banged a day in their life just to try to get some clout and dance and shit when I hang out. But then when shit hits the fan, it's not good. Mm, I hear that. I hear that, man. What was the jalapeno thing? Oh, that God. That's in, uh, that was in uh, the prison. That was in the prison. Like people would say, uh, cause since 2018, uh, pretty much if how, wherever your point system's at, your point system, how much time you have, it's wherever they're gonna send you. So most times they'll send you. You'll be five percent real mother and ninety five percent customers in that mother. <laughs> That's just how it is, you know. And pretty much it's uh, a lot of the guys they they're trying to get to MCRP, trying to get another little program and do this and do that. They, they, that's, that's what they're trying to do. So pretty much he went in debt. He couldn't pay his debt. So they offered, you know, to beat his ass. They already was going to beat his ass. But as soon as they swung on him, he just started screaming. They didn't even hit him yet. So guess what they did now? They stuffed him with jalapenos in his ass. Now, the guys, they kept telling me the story about it. I'm like, that, that can't see true. And he finally told me, he told me one night, he said, Crip Mac, he said, please stop these guys from bullying me. So I let him know like this. I said, cuz, as long as I'm here and cuz here, I don't harbor no custers. I don't like custers. But as long as I'm here and cuz here, because cuz, it, it was, I guess it was the luck of Jesus, some neighborhood Crip. Cuz, well, was, was, went home a week to see five me. You five me? So, oh, Hustas, I was able to talk with the guys. They're like, Crip Mac, we're going to leave him alone. You know what I'm saying? So they left him alone. They didn't beat him up, put no more jalapenos in his ass, and they let him go home. You know, so he respected that. But it's like, God damn. And I was talking with Lily Cakes on the phone. Girl. I'm like, God damn, this man had a jalapeno in his ass. And his excuse was he, didn't, he was going home soon. He didn't want to lose his release date. Lily Cakes ain't no Custer. She's a real crip, just like myself. That's Custer shit. Lose your release date. That's it that's out there on neighborhood crib. Lose your release date. Protect your asshole, Custer. And that's what Cud didn't do. He didn't want to fight. That's his problem, you know, on hood. Shout out to Jalapeno Man. Man, that's, you, you know, you know, people probably wouldn't expect you to be like such a, a cool dude that you stopped this dude from getting bullied. Well, Cud, I'm not a bully. You find me? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, a, I'm not a bully. You know what I mean? That's the difference with different gangbangers. I'm not a bully. No, Hustas, I hate my enemies. I do my enemies wrong. I'm neighborhood crip, but I'm, I'm, I'm fair at the end of the day. I give out fair fades and uh, deliver hot meals and deliver hot shells. <laughs> neighborhood crip. Where's that, like where's that. that come from? I mean, that's just me. That's Crip Mac. Feed the homeless and still do destruction. The world loves it. It's me. What's up? This is Cam Capone. We got more content like this coming soon. So hit that like button. Subscribe. And stay locked in to Cam Capone News.